This chicken's really not going to live long. Today, I'm uh, in the van down the Rhone Valley with Clément uh, because I want to visit uh, an architectural salvage place uh, because I need a bracket for holding the wall down the garden because the, the, um, we have a piece of the, guard, of the wall that collapsed and uh, a big crack appeared, so we need to reinforce that. And so I wanted something uh, reasonably nice looking because it will be visible. Um, and the, that place told me uh, they have uh, actually one that could do the, the trick. I love this place. So I've got my bracket. Uh, this will, uh, it's really nicely wrote and it will uh, really do the trick. I'm really pleased with that. I put Clément in bed and now I'm going to do some clearing with the digger um, because uh, we have a piece of wall that collapsed last winter and the, that's, we have a big crack and we need to rebuild it and uh, do a bit of preparatory work. So I'm off to that now. <laughs> For the last few years, we had three very dry summers followed by one uh, very wet autumn, uh, so two years ago. And this caused the soil to swell after being very dry. And it's pushed all this bit of the wall out and uh, all the front of the terrace forward. And so the, um, we started rebuilding this wall but then we realized the big crack had appeared um, along here because it was still pushing. And so that's why I need to put a, a big rod going through the wall with the bracket holding all this bit and before we, um, we carry on rebuilding the rest of the wall. This pile are uh, all the stones that uh, fell down with the wall. So now I need to put them back up to the on the terrace so that it's easier to rebuild the wall.
This chicken's not gonna live long. chickens being annoying. at the top, so I'll call Hervé, the stonemason, to come and rebuild the wall, because he'll do a much better job than me. Um, I still need to provide him with a big rod to put the bracket and uh, inside the wall. So I'll, uh, I'll go to the, um, the hardware store tomorrow to get that. Put a rod, um, a big iron rod that will go inside the wall. And what I'm going to do now is weld this uh, this bolt at the end, so that I can put the bracket like this and bolt it into the wall to hold everything. So the the iron rod will be anchored in uh, inside the wall in concrete, and so it, the wall that's falling will be held by a bolt and this, uh, this bracket. So uh, I need to make sure the welding I'm doing is very solid. Uh, this is an old bolt from an electric line uh, that I found in the, in the woods. Uh, it's really perfect because it's a big uh, diameter, but it's galvanized, so I need to make sure I... Um, I uh, remove all the, the zinc before I weld, otherwise my, uh, my welding won't hold.
chicken's really not going to live long. Attends. I hadn't seen him coming, actually. And it sounds like a hen laid an egg in the workshop. So I need to go and check that. So I've uh, grinded the, the connection for the... So to make sure it's all, uh, all connected. And now I need to line this up. So I'm, um, I'm going to try and hold it in place. It doesn't need to be extremely accurate because it will be all uh, in the the concrete it just needs to to hold ah, no. drugs better if i plug it Didn't hold. <coughs> Need to grind it again. I won't get an award, but it should hold. I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna do a bit more. Perfect. So I think that should hold. Hopefully. So it will come like this. And then it will be bolted to the wall. Um, so the next stage here is just to wait for Hervé, isn't it? To yeah. come and do the work. 
Yeah, so the, it's all ready for him to come. Yeah. Uh, I'll need to take the digger on the other side, but I'll do that when he's here to pull the, the stones back. Yeah. But it was quite a big detour, so I'll, yeah, uh, yeah. I'll wait till he's here. I um, uh, hope it doesn't collapse anymore before he gets here. Yeah, I think it should be okay. Yeah. Unless we have to reach <laughs> rains. <laughs> Will you need to help him with the lifting of the stones and stuff? I think he'll be coming with the little crane. Uh, oh, okay, so cool. He should be okay. That's one of the things that issues we have here, that the reason we jump around from one project to another is because a lot of the time we rely on other people and they get booked up on other projects. So we just have to do what we can and then move on to another project and then as soon as they're ready we jump back again and and stuff mm. but um we hope you're enjoying what you're seeing happening on the the estate here and the huge amount of projects that we've got um and if you are enjoying it please don't forget to like and to subscribe to the channel because uh, the bigger the channel gets uh, the more projects we can do here basically yep exactly <laughs> and thank you very much for watching bye